hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm just going to quickly show you how to make rose water and um i have here my bowl my jojoba oil so why i'm using jojoba oil today is because you jojoba oil is close to the oil the natural oil from your skin you know how you have oily face is exactly the oil that comes from jojoba oil it's the same thing so i'm going to be using water so i will boil my water and i'm going to be needing a blender so i'm, I'm going to be using my smoothie blender to do that and then um, this is my rose pet house it's a little bit um dried and that doesn't mean it will not work so watch it out and i'm going to be using this um, lovely um spray bottle and the essence of rose water is when you wake up in the morning it helps you wake up it helps you give you that glow that pinkish glow that you need to start up your day and also if you need someone asked me a question concerning red lips how do you get your lips red and um, this could obviously help you get your lip red and i'm going to show you how to do that so let's get um started i'm going to go ahead and boil this water and then i'll show you the next steps so stay tuned so guys i've boiled my water and um, i'm going to go ahead and um, open this bottle and go ahead and put all the holes both petals inside the bottle then i'll pour the water hot water not to i'm going to um because of the bottle i'm going to go ahead and then mix the water with a little bit of cold water and i'll blend it then we'll get to the next step so stay tuned while i make the water a little bit um, a little bit warm not too hot and then i blend it i do not want to show you guys the noise like i don't want you to hear the noise because it's going to be obviously loud and then i'll be back Get warm water in there with the hot water so it's a bit mild not too hot not too cold so i'm going to go ahead and blend this and then i will show you guys what it looks like after i finish blending because believe me you the noise is going to be too much and i don't want you guys to experience that noise so i'll be back hey guys so i have finished blending the rose water and um, i didn't add that i've been needing this sieve to be able to sieve it and um, strain it and get the water out so i'm gonna go ahead and get this opened oh my goodness this smells so good mm. i'm telling you it smells so good so i'm gonna go ahead and strain the water Ooh. that dark pink color look at this this is beautiful look at that pink color so you can use your hands my hands are clean you can use it press it down to make sure that every water comes out as you can see it still has more water in there So everything is totally out. Um, I'm going to wash my hands quickly and I clean my hands with this um, yes, yes. then I'm going to go ahead and add my jojoba oil to it just a few drops Here 
yeah look at my fingers they're already pink you know so i'm gonna go ahead and add to my spray bottle and then pour the remaining of this rose water in here because i obviously know this is not gonna fit in here so i pour in here and um, whenever i need it i could take from here and refill to my bottle so let's go there so guys this is the remaining of the rose water as you can see it's, it's pink and um, the reason why it's a little bit dark pink is because i left my rose to dry up a little bit and um, let me tell you this rose was given was gifted to me and then the rose for my birthday and the rose has gotten um, a little bit dry like i was tired of looking at it and i said to myself what am i gonna do with this rose i don't want to get rid of it so i went ahead and then um, got this rose and do what i did with it today so if you've got a gift um a um, rose that you are gifted and you don't know what you just want to bin it don't bin it you can make something out of it just like i did here today look at my rose water i could go ahead and wake up in the morning and spread this on my face to hydrate my face or before my makeup i go ahead and spread this on my face just to wake my face up and then i'm good to go there are so many benefits to rose water you can read it out up and um, do more research on this so that you know what i'm talking about and um, some people ask me how do you get the pink lips add this to your um, lip balm or wet lips or whatever you use just add this to it or in the morning just take a cutting board take this and rub it on your lips and you'll be glad you did i promise maybe the fresh rose would be really good if you use a fresh one but this one mostly goes on the face when you spread so the fresh rose when you pound it and then squeeze the water out you can put it to your lip balm maybe i'll demonstrate that out sometime to show you guys what it looks like so i hope you love this video and i hope you learned some, something from it and i'll see you guys in my next other video thank you for watching bye